Okay, so my name's Tim Smith, and I'm Publishing Manager at IP Publishing, and I'm really pleased to, hear, to be here at Graphene Week 2014, where I'm here specifically to engage with uh, researchers working on graphene and broader two-dimensional materials to talk about uh, a new journal in the IOP materials portfolio. Uh, 2D materials um, launched just this year, and we published our first content in April. It's a new journal which we think for the first time will provide, a, I guess, a truly multidisciplinary outlet for the two-dimensional materials community that really recognises the many scientific communities extending across physics, chemistry, biology and engineering that are now engaging and working with graphene and the emerging new materials that are coming out of that. Um, so uh, speaking with the community this week, there's been already been a lot of interest in the journal and we're really pleased and honoured actually to have the endorsement of the graphene flagship for the journal. Um, we're publishing a focus issue of invited contributions linked with Graphene Week this week. Um, um, and this is all part of the launch phase for the journal in which we're looking to, to engage as much as possible with the community. So 2D Materials itself um, is, as I say, a broad multidisciplinary scope journal. Um, we're pitching it very high in terms of the quality standards. It publishes letters um, that will report um, urgent breakthrough results, regular research articles that are, are length unlimited, invited topical reviews as guided by the editorial board, and also perspectives which are also commissioned um, from leading figures in the field to talk about specific papers within the journal and to put them in a, in a, in a broader context. Um, so we're at the really early stages of the journal. Um, um, it's part of the overall IOP materials program of titles that already to a certain extent uh, serve the graphene in two-dimensional materials. And we see this actually as a really exciting new title within our overall program and one that we look forward to um, ensuring um, really serves the entire community as well as possible.